Hey everybody and welcome to this video. I'm Inkslaura123 and this is going to be a shopping haul video. So basically I went shopping as ever, I know because I'm a shopaholic. I got some goodies and in this video I'm going to show you what I bought. Now if you enjoy the video, which I really hope you do, please click like, please comment and please subscribe to my channel. That would be awesome. And please don't forget to click that notification bell and then you can see when I'm doing live streaming or I've uploaded new videos. Okay, so by the way, I'm wearing this uh, red vest top so I feel like I should sing this song. <clears throat> Lady in red is dancing with me. <laughs> cheek to cheek. Anyway, let's get on with the shopping haul. So the first thing I want to show you, these really cute t-shirts, which I got from Primark. If you're a regular viewer, you know that I love Primark. Like, literally, I am Primark obsessed, I think. Uh, so these were like £2.50 each, and they're just so cute, and I love them. So the first one is this lovely, like, dark cherry colour, like a whiny red, and it's got the pink and the white stripes on it. But the thing I love best about this t-shirt is the little message it has on it, which is always unique. And I truly believe that. I think you should always be yourself, always be unique. Don't be afraid to be different. And I just saw it and I really loved it. And also over the eye, they've got like a little heart, which I think is really super cute. I just really like this t-shirt. I think it's lovely. And I love the coloring of it as well. So yeah, £2.50 bargain um, and also I love this one here this has just come in like I'd not seen this one at all so it is a white t-shirt but it's got lots of red lips all over it and some of the lips have got like the, the tongue poking out some of them are just like smiling and pouting and some of them have like a little kind of naughty little cherry in the lips which I think is quite sexy <laughs> but no it's just a really cute t-shirt I love it and I yeah I was like wow I need that in my life. I've actually got a shirt which is a bit similar to this. It's got like lipstick kiss design all over it. Um, but this just really made me laugh, like especially like little tongue poking out and stuff. I just, I love it. So two new t-shirts. Okay, so next I've got some books. Now I know not everyone who watches my videos is like a bookworm, like I am. So I'm not gonna go like into too much detail about these books. I'm just gonna show you them quickly. But I will be doing a new book haul video. So if you are into books, look out for that video this week because there will be a new book haul video, okay? Showing you all the new books that I have got. So the first one I wanna show you is by Grady Hendrix and it's called We Sold Our Souls. I'm loving this. Actually, my clothing is kind of going with this. Look, the black and red, black and red. And so this is a uh, supposed to be a really great book. I don't know, I haven't read it yet, but I've heard really good, exciting things about it. It's about a rock band, like a, a rock metal band. Also a little bit of like Satan worshiping and selling your soul to the devil and that kind of thing. I just spat on myself, that was horrible. Anyway, so <laughs> yeah, this is like a really cool like sounding book to me. I love Grady Hendrick's book. Uh, he's done a book called My Best Friend's Exorcism, which I really love that book. And I've also got Horror Store by the same author to read as well. So I picked this up from Waterstones. And the next book that I got is Times Convert and it's by Deborah Harkness, who wrote the absolutely fantastic All Souls trilogy. So there are a different uh, couple of covers, but I got this cover, which is my favorite cover. It's the red cover with like the clock on it I'm literally so freaking excited to read this book I really loved the trilogy so it was a discovery of witches shadow of night and book of life and I'm really excited to read this this is kind of in the same world with some of the same characters and I, I literally when I read these books at the time like back in the day quite a while ago I read all like the Discovery of Witches books I fell in love with them they're so good so well wrote and now there's the television show as well on Sky One on a Friday night so yeah I feel like I'm kind of really back in this world so I think she's bought this book out at just the right time what with the TV show and stuff the other book I want to show you quickly is this one uh, this is by Robert Dins Dinsdale and it's called The Toy Makers look at this cover this cover is like intense amazing um, like even the back is really beautiful uh, so this is about this toy shop and the toys like start coming to life and it's supposed to be a bit similar to night circus kind of um it's had really good reviews online and i just i think i'm kind of a sucker for a good looking cover this beautiful book cover but it does sound like the sort of story um that i would read like toys coming to life and yeah it just sounds like really spooky and creepy and just magical so i picked that one up 
Okay, so next up I got this. So this is just really funny. So this is a bottle opener and I got it from one of my bosses at work because we always get him like little cheeky, funny, novelty uh, Christmas gifts. And this is one of them. We've got him a few others. So this is a bottle opener and it says uh, <laughs> bus one open on these. So as you can see, where the boobies are is where you would open the bottle. So it's just a pound and it's something to add in his little bundle of gifts and he will find that quite funny. They do have a man's one as well of like the muscles and stuff. So, you know, I think they're pretty funny. Okay, what else? Also, I've got some Halloween bits and pieces to show you. I got these uh, hollow milk chocolate treats and they are eyeballs. I see you. I see you. <laughs> So yeah, just like a bag of chocolate um, eyeballs, and yeah, these are just for Halloween. I'm so excited for Halloween, like it's not even, I'm, yeah, I'm really hyper for Halloween. Also, I picked up, um, where are they? Oh, here they are. These gorgeous little bottles right here. So these are for Halloween, and they've only just come in, so I had to get them. So we've got the little black bottle here, the poison bottle. <laughs> um, and then there's this like yellowy greeny kind of glass bottle there which is also the poison if you look really closely and uh, then there's this one it's really cute this is silver and it's got a cat on it black cat saying happy Halloween happy Halloween so I really like these bottles and yeah I love I literally love all Halloween stuff like, I love looking around the shops just like getting Halloween goodies you know spooky stuff talking about spooky stuff i also got this um you're probably thinking what is that but it's supposed to be like a crystal ball like a witch's crystal ball and it's color changing so there's a little switch right under there i didn't get this from poundland by the way i got this from a local fancy dress shop so there we go so it starts off red and then it kind of goes green i think it goes blue as well when i was testing it i think it went blue like purple um but i just think it's really cool and i'm going to be using it in uh videos on my other youtube channel oh yeah by the way any of you that don't know i've got another youtube channel minx laura 123 asmr and i make asmr videos to help people with you know insomnia anxiety uh, relaxation videos basically and some of the videos that i do are role plays yeah, it's starting to sound a bit weird now, but uh, yeah, I do like witch role plays if it's Halloween or I pretend to be a vampire and <laughs> so, anyway, but I thought this would be perfect for a witch role play. Um, I've bought these like witch nails, like long nails and I can, anyway, so that that's cool. Uh, also, what else have we got? Oh yeah, oh my God, this is amazing. I got a rainbow theme jumper from Primark. <sighs> I'm loving this so much. And it's back to front that's better so it's just plain pink at the top but as you lift it up rainbow and the sleeves are there, like rainbow as well i really love this so this was um 13 pound and it's just come in so i really like it i wish the rainbow would have gone all the way up like that but it's still cool the rainbow is like you know from the middle downwards but yeah it's really nice and thick and warm so it's gonna be great for winter and I really, really love it. It's so cute. I love all things rainbow and stuff like that. So I was like, yes, I got it. Um, da, 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 what else? Oh, yeah, I've got this cap as well. Like a rose gold cap. And it says good vibes on it. Good vibes, baby. Love and peace. But I really like it because, first of all, I love that message of good vibes. You need good vibes in the world. Mm -hmm. Positivity, spread the love and all that jazz. But I really like the colour. The colour is gorgeous, so if I pop it on now quick, you can see. I've, I've got to like adjust it at the back and stuff, but there it is. But yeah, it needs adjusting, it needs to be a bit tighter, I think. But um, no, I really like it. Probably messed my hair up now. Um, but I will confess, this was from the, uh, the kids section in Primark. <laughs> but the problem is, right, I've got a big mouth. But I've got a little head, right? So when I go and choose like adult hats, they're just too big for my head. I have to wear like kids hats, kids caps. There we go. Um, also, I got Nathan a present, which I'm not going to lie to you, I did actually put on myself. So, because uh, <laughs> I like it. Maybe I'll borrow it as well. But um, this is so awesome. It is a Cookie Monster onesie. 
So, I mean, look, it was in the men's section, but I think clothes should just be, like, you know, genderless. If you want to wear men's, if you want to wear women's, just wear what you want, you know what I mean? I love this so much. Like, seriously, look at the eyes. So, yeah, it's about, that's the hood bit. And um, you've got the little, where's the cookie? There's a cookie dangling down somewhere at the front on the zip. Yeah, so it zips up all the way. Where's the cookie? Lost the cookie. Hold on. Oh, here's the cookie. I know it was there. So that's on the zip, the little cookies on the zip. And at the back of it, by the way, it's so soft and fluffy, like literally. Oh, it's so nice. It's like, it feels like a blanket. I could probably go to sleep, like, you know, wearing this. But um, yeah, at the back it says hungry, <laughs> which I think is really funny because Cookie Monster is always uh, hungry. Um, but what I'll do, um, I'll include a photograph that I took of Nathan wearing the Cookie Monster onesie. Um, yeah, because I let him try it on, make sure it fit him and everything. And I was like, can I take a photo to include in my video of the shopping haul? He's like, no. I was like, please. And he's like, okay. So, yes, he uh, has a photograph of him wearing this that I can include in the video. But it's really cool. It's so awesome and fluffy. And I love the blue. And I, I really love Cookie Monster, so... Yeah, that was, I don't know how much that was. So I think it was like £16. Where's the price tag? I can't find the price tag now. Where's it gone? Oh, here it is. So Sesame Street, yeah, it was £16. So, yeah, loving that. <laughs> okay, um, what else have I got to show you? There's nothing left in that bag. Um, there's a bottle of Coke Zero, which... I didn't, um, I just took with me, like, because I get thirsty when I'm shopping, so I can't really make that, like, something I bought, because I just took it with me when I went out. Um, I did buy these two little, um, baby, um, what are they called? Baby Grows? Is it called a Baby Grow? I don't know. Anyway, so yeah, these are for Halloween. Uh, they're newborns. My first Halloween, and, uh, this one I like. I love my mummy. Did you get it? Mummy? Yeah. So, I got those two as well because I have I know some people think they're really creepy but I'm just gonna be honest I do have two reborn baby dolls and <laughs> yeah as I say some people are like cool with it and you know other people are not so cool with it and it weirds them out so I'm not gonna like talk about it too much but I do have two reborn baby dolls one's a girl and one's a boy so I thought I could dress them up for Halloween and stuff Anyway, hopefully you've uh, enjoyed this video. I don't think there's anything else left in these bags. Nope. So, uh, yeah, please click like, comment, subscribe. Tell me what you like the best. Um, I think I've got to have to go with my rainbow jumper. No, actually, no. Sorry, rainbow jumper. You're a close second. Yes, I'm talking to clothes. It's a bit weird. I have to say Cookie Monster, the onesie, because it's just so awesome and cute and soft and fluffy and lovely. So yeah, I'll see you really soon. Don't forget all the links to my social media are down below. Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Goodreads. If you're a fellow bookworm like myself, come follow me on there. And as I say, I do have another YouTube channel, MinxLaw123 ASMR. Link is down below to that as well. All right, everyone, thank you for watching. Uh, you are all awesome and lovely. Take care of yourselves and I'll see you soon. Mwah. Bye.